Okay, now don't get bogged down with this hand tie bouquet. Okay? Everybody, when they come to the workshops, they all ooh, go absolutely crazy when they thought of a hand tie, but it's really, really easy. We've just got a mixture of various flowers. I've got some gypsum, some alstro, hypericum, leaves, roses, chrysanthemums, eucalyptus, a bit of twigs. You start with a focal flower, pick any flower, or pick a rose up, and everything you do is turned to the side. So we put this in the middle and turn it to the side. And that is all you're doing. Really, really simple. So we're just creating a circle. So all the stems are spiralling. Just pick any bits off. Put some foliage in between it and turn. So this is going to help it stay in position. So you don't have to put things in circles, fives, threes. I think a nice mixture the flowers looks gorgeous lots of interesting foliages interesting textures we love textures at Rosa Ragosa this is beautiful a lotus head I'm just gonna look just easy shove it down in the middle beautiful put some alstro around and turn so all you need for this is your string and your scissors no big oasis jobs or anything just look how it's coming together so quick and if like they do disappear a bit even mine disappear after all i've done just pop them up pull them up it's, it's not a problem we'll put some softness in some gypsophilia around the edge to create a nice collar on this ami around the edge you can rest it on the table. Can you see how I'm like leaning it on the table? This is just going to help you. You need really big wrists, strong wrists. That's the only thing you do need. You've got like really strong arms once you've done this because the absolute way a ton. When you send them out to the brides, it's like, oh, I hope the bridesmaid's going to take it off her and hold it for her. I'm just going to finish now. Can you see how it's spiralled? Just by turning. It, it's not hard, just turn and flick the little bits off there gorgeous we'll put a bit of interest in a, a bamboo and some twigs at the side a couple of leaves which we're going to staple you're going to i love my stapler you will see that string here check it off clear all the mess off it's nice to have a nice clean station then I'm just tying it off hold the stems really tight together rest them on the table and just cut cut across Again, you need strong hands for this. Just go through all of them, try to get it, do it in a few goes. Chop the middles out. This is just going to help it stand a bit better. Get rid of your mess. Oh, I missed one. Now we're going to wrap it. So I've got a square solid box, it's really strong these, and I've just put some paper inside it because it holds it a little bit better. I've got some cellophane which is about a metre big and I fold it in half because I think it just protects it a little bit more in case we get a leak. You put the hand tied in the middle, gather it up all the way around the sides. Another piece of string, tie it round, then get your paper, we use this thread, I know this, you get your paper and you just make two little flags, hold it like that. And you've got two points there, you put your flowers, 
in the middle. Wrap it round. Get your jug of water. Just gently. You can feel when it's heavy enough. Just have a little check if you want. All the stems are covered. And this is the finished result. And we're just going to pop it in the box. Finished. Magic created. Just a few little fancy little twists on your leaves. There we go, one hand tied.